finds Brazil. Ballaroo jumper from the free throw line is good, and Ole Miss is on the board. Here for UT Martin trying to slow him down, but Erica Sis always attacking the basket. All the way to the rim, Erica Sis with her first points, and Ole Miss cuts it to three, seven to four. And there's a steal. Tia Fallaroo ahead of the pack, trying to take it coast to coast. With Asia Jones chasing, she can't catch her. That's my first time being, I'm on vacation, and <laughs> it showed this show. We got blue out. <laughs> Strong move there by Queen Hayes. She gets to the inside. Rebels got the lead back to three. It's 11-8. UT Martin with the advantage. Leading this team as a freshman. What a great honor for her. Shaquille Joseph knocks out the three. Singletary in the game right now. Kicks it into the corner. Long jumper on the way. And friendly bounce that time for Danielle McCray to keep possession alive. Sisk dumps it off. Fallaroo, baseline jumper. Good from 12 feet. Beautiful Long jumper shot. on the way. Briggs works down the right side. Finds a little space. A little eight foot jumper. Good for Kelsey Briggs. UT Martin, one shot. Golden tries a three from the corner, wide open, and she knocks it out. Seven-point lead for Ole Miss, their biggest of the game. In Atlanta, three on the way, and it's good. <laughs> That's the second one of the ball wow. game for Kiara Golden. Focused on who you need to stop. Joseph going to try three with the shot clock winding down. Wow. It's dead center. Down to five. Briggs left open on the wing. She'll wow. try a three, and she got it. <laughs> wide open look for Kelsey Briggs. Shot clock, here's Sisk on the wing. And with Briggs being in the game, she's able to spread the floor and shoot the three. Little bit of space there. <laughs> Erica Sisk takes a step back and knocks out the three. Allery gives it out front to Briggs. She's going to try three and got it. Ole Miss, two made threes to start the second half. And Frizzell into the corner. Sisk goes baseline and gets the runner. The traffic throws up the scoop, can't get it to go. And then Joseph comes up with it. Shot clock did not reset. Briggs and one. Has the loose ball. Briggs everywhere right now. Pulls up just inside the free throw She's line. It. Dead center. <laughs> She's feeling it. Queen Hayes, long pass ahead, throws over the pressure. Oh, wow. Zip pass inside. Wow. Fowleru with the finish. Da -na -na, da -na -na. <laughs> Here's Hayes. Fowleru, jumper on the baseline. It's good. Evan barely touched the net. And textbook offense from Ole Miss. The patience from the... Ole Miss looking for a bucket. They find Gracie Frizzell. She fires up a three and got it. First point to the ball game for Gracie Frizzell, and now Matt Insel will take a timeout. Wide open three, no. Fallaroo gets a rebound and a putback. A little bit of a pick there. Five to shoot. Frizzell, a little runner, and got the friendly roll from about six feet. Murray State here at Tad Pad, trying Haley to go Howard 2 0. Overshot that one, now Ole Miss. And so Queen Hayes. She finds Frizzell. Briggs on the baseline. Got nice. the jumper to fall. That's 17 points for Kelsey Briggs. Ole Miss breaks the pressure, gets it ahead. Nice. Hayes able to finish. Now you think about this Ole Miss team. They've got wins against three of the SEC teams in the NCAA tournament. Uh, Erica Sisk there. UT Martin pressing. Pass ahead for Ole Miss. Oh, nice. Inside, Another Kelsey great pass. Briggs. 19 points. Upset, 64-60. And Coach By Tennessee Maddox, State. Still not smiling yet, huh? <laughs> More work to be done, he says. And then tonight in the first round of the women's NIT, come on the road to Oxford in the SEC to take on Ole Miss. And their season comes to an end. Ole Miss.